What's up, One Wheel Nation? Adam here from Future Motion, and today we've got an epic app update to talk about. Before we do, make sure you're subscribed, like this video, put a comment below just saying what's up. Let's dive into it. All right, folks, so we have a lot of new features to talk about today. And a lot of these features are things that folks have been asking for for a while, so we're super pumped up to bring this update to y'all. One of the biggest changes that we have implemented is going from a board-centric model within the One Wheel app to a user-centric model in the One Wheel app. What does that mean? Instead of having all of your miles logged to a particular board, we are logging all of those miles to your username. So you could ride your board, a spare board, Pint, XR, Plus, doesn't matter, grab your friend's board, all of those miles are gonna be logged under your username so that you can continue to get those miles pretty freaking awesome. As if riding your one wheel wasn't fun enough, now there are a boatload of badges that you can ride for, strive for, and unlock your ultimate one wheel potential. You can now challenge yourself to ride the height of Mount Everest or descent to the depths of the Mariana Trench to unlock some pretty sweet badges. So the cool thing about the badges is that everybody is starting off on a clean slate. And don't get worried now, we're not erasing the miles you've already ridden, but with this new feature, everybody gets to start off at the same point. Whatever the badge is, we're excited to see One Wheel Nation get after it, claim some badges, and spread the stoke. Now moving on to another new feature, board offline and auto connect. With the new board offline feature, you never have to worry about missing your stats if you shut your board off immediately after a ride. With your app open, once you turn your, off your board, the stat page will pop up immediately. Within this page is a feature to auto connect to a particular board once you turn your board on and open the app. Gone are the days of opening the app, waiting for your board to pop up and connecting it manually. The future is rad, my friends. Last but not least, charging stations and food. You can now designate a particular location as a charging station and tag on if there's food available at it. This could be a deli, coffee shop, or even your special outdoor charging spot. It's pretty simple to do so. Just click the yellow lightning bolt with the plus sign in the top right corner, drag the marker to the desired location, and specify whether it's just a place to charge or a place you can charge and grab a bite to eat. Once created, other riders can give this a thumbs up or a thumbs down to help ensure it's a solid spot to charge. Pretty awesome feature. We're excited about that. I've already used it a couple times but Jack led me to actually a, a dead outlet. Thumbs down. All in all, we're super proud of this app update and you could totally expect us to build off of this foundation. I mean, who knows? You might be seeing some FM initiated challenges in the future. Well, my friends, that's all we have for today. Thanks for joining in One Wheel Nation. Remember, number one thing, subscribe. Number two, like this video. Three, just go out and be a great person. Have a great time shredding. Be well, be safe, and shred on.